Well, how do that, chums? Tis I, Captain of the Steers, today, chums, for you guys out there in the viewer verse. I've got a little bit of a cup of tea with Captain Steve episode, yes, and it's about No Man's Sky, and it's about the Wonders catalogue and my Wonders quest that usually happens on a Monday. I say usually because there's going to be a change to that. Yeah, anyway, let's uh, have a little sip of my tea, and then we're going to get into it, people. Oh. It's a bit warm. Okay, right. Let's jump on over into game. Kaboom! There I am on the screen inside a game. I say on the screen. I'm not on the screen, am I? I need to make myself visible. There we go. Kaboom! Well, oh, that didn't do it. There we go. Now I'm visible. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, well that that went swimmingly well, didn't it? Lovely, jubbly. I know. Kaboom! Thumbs up. There we go. Anyhow, let's jump on over into the catalogue and let's show you the Wonders catalogue. So this is what I've been doing my live streams on, this Wonders catalogue down here. You can see here, I've found 20 of the 78 Wonders to be found. Well, let's go in there and let's count my, my find, shall we? One, two, three on that page. Okay, and on this one, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Planet Records. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That's the 20 so far. Go into Fauna Records. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, 33, and 34. Okay. 34. <laughs> 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. And 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. I've actually found 46 wonders, people. Not 20. So that's a little bit broken. Something else that's a little bit broken is when you go into every single one of these tabs and count every single space in here, it comes to 60-something. Not 70 freaking 8, mate. <laughs> okay? So for a game that's based on freaking math, the math just doesn't add up. Go in, do your own counting, and see whether your Wonders catalogue is as screwed as mine. And when we <laughs> when we go into here, okay, if I go into, say, the mineral records, all right, you can see this one's got a name on it, NMSA Magnetic. Great, that's what I named it. But this one, I've named this one NMSA Electric. Go into here, you can see, oh, fudging heck. I, I did name it <laughs> as NMSA Electric, but it seems to have lost its bloody name. And yeah, that's that's just the thing. At the moment, things that you name seem to unname themselves on a regular basis. So one, the math doesn't add up, and two, the actual discoveries that you've found don't freaking add up. So at the moment, people, the Wonders catalogue is broken to freaking fudge. Yes, complete fudgery, people, inside of the viewerverse, I tell thee. Fudgery indeed. Yes, yeah, so check yours and see if it is as broken as mine. Sound off in the comments. Let me know. Um, I mean, I can't see this as by design. I mean, I might send out a load of my um, frigates on missions to bring back some most valuable of treasures and see if I can populate this page as well. But I bet you that I think these ones add in. The weird thing is, I think treasures add in and I think collected git glitches add in. And that is pretty much it. Because it can't be doing all of these because I don't know what it selects. I don't know what my 20 is. It's freaking weird, people inside of the view of us. Unless when you go to some of these, I mean, if, if I hollow over, it says discovered by Captain Steve. That one isn't, okay? That one was discovered by Sayawan. So does that one count as my discovery? Or is it Sayawan's discovery? Why is it in my mementos if they found the frigging thing? And maybe they found it and I've also been there, so it adds it into mine. I don't know. I don't know what counts and what stacks as part of that 20. Look, Dave the Grim found that, so maybe I should subtract that. But I don't know. I don't know if this is working by design or whether it's a bug. Is it a bug? Is it a feature? You tell me. Yeah. But even, even with that, you know, a lot of these are discovered by me. And even these, discovered by Captain Steve, Dave the Grim, Captain Steve... Even if it is that, I've got more than 20 that are discovered by Captain Steve. Because I've gone through and counted these too. You know, there's freaking loads. So, I, I really don't know what's going on, people. But, for now, I think the actual Wonders catalogue is bloody broken. 
Broken to toffee and fudgery people inside of the view of us. I mean, look, I've scanned over all of these, so if you really want to, you can count these back at home. But trust me, there's far more than 20 that I've discovered myself. Okay, one, two, three, four, just in there, by me. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. So I've just counted 21. I haven't even gone into planetary records yet. But there's a load here, you know, 20, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, okay, 28. And it doesn't say who discovered these, but that doesn't bloody help, does it? Anyway, there's 28 there that says discovered by Captain Steve, right? That still says 20. So that, that's what I'm getting at. It's completely broken. We've had a whole shed load of freaking patches. And in some of the patches, it said that the discoveries have been fixed. They haven't. So, yeah, I'm going to be ditching doing Wonder Quest until this actually gets fixed. And even when it comes back in... I'm in two minds whether to bring it back to my channel. I did enjoy doing it, though. Did enjoy doing it. And, uh, yeah, people on Discord got involved. But I have got a new Discord event that's taking place, people in the view of us. So, yeah, I'll jump on over. I'll hit this up, and uh, I'll show you what I'm going to be doing in place of Wonder Quests on Mondays. Let's people. jump on over onto Tinterwebs now, people. I guess. Lovely jubbly. Here's me on the side of the Tinterwebs. And yes, I put out on my community tab about this. So here we go. Wonders Quests on Mondays is no longer happening as it seems broken. <laughs> Making a video today. You're watching it right now, people. Mondays will become a podcast. All things channel related. Mondays members Mooch, also known as Mmm. Yes, yeah, sounds yummy, doesn't it? Sounds super freaking delightful. Who cares? Anyway, the basic loose agenda for this is a subject to change. You know, this is a bit vague because it's going to be the first one. If this doesn't work, I'd be changing it up. But hello, welcome and all that jazz. So, yeah, this is the new podcast, blah, blah, blah. No Man's Sky, Hello Games and Sean Murray Tweets. There's everything No Man's Sky related. If I've got anything, I'll share it with you. Community tab and spotlights. So that's looking at the community tab over on actual um, YouTube. If I've done any polls, things like that, reading out your comments and going through some feedbacks maybe jumping over to the discord taking a look in the old discord scene because i need to start using discord a bit more i guess because i am going to be hosting a dialing you can call in anyway games i have my eye on that i want to bring to the channel things that i'm looking forward to things that i'm excited about raise a smile upon your face yes all that sort of stuff speculation on any of these games in no man's sky it's like a lot of the games that i'm looking at it's like um yeah hold on Right, so, so, yeah, one of those games that is on my radar right now is Starfield. Now, there's quite a lot of speculation that could be had around Starfield and also the likenesses to No Man's Sky and all that sort of good stuff, and that might make a very good first podcasty type thing to cover off. I guess, if you've got any other ideas, hit us up inside of the comments. Yes, vlog and general real-world stuff. So... I'm going to be embarking over to the Philippines on a journey fairly soon in April, so I might be talking about that, for example. Or I might just be talking about the stuff that I did over the weekend. Since this is a Monday, I might let you know what I got up to. That sort of shenanigans, you know? And then we're going to be talking about events. So we have got the UK, UK, No Man's Sky meetup happening this year at the tail end of... August, yeah, so the August bank holiday in the UK. Community plugs, so yeah, I might sort of give a few shout outs some, to some awesome videos or things I've seen around the community, and then maybe put a raid over to another live stream at the end. I may even put out a little bit of what I'm bringing to my channel as well and some plugs around myself. Yeah, so that sort of stuff, shameless plugging. Yeah, lovely jubbly. Anyhow, it's going to be live on YouTube for all members of my YouTube channel to watch. So you have to be a member to actually be there live and into the live chat and stuff like that. But not only that, you can jump on over onto Discord and you can jump on in and be on my actual Discord live chat and, and chime in on all of these things.
Yes, Patreon will be able to dial in on Discord and listen and talk, but they won't be able to watch live. Sadly, I can't work out how to get that to work for Patreon peoples. I've also got an area called Pedigree Chums. So Pedigree Chums are people that I've assigned into a group that can jump in and listen and talk. Some of these people have been previous backers, but because of the way the world is right now, you know, financially, they, they might not be able to be able back me anymore. And so I still recognize those people because they've been there since day dot. They helped me get my channel off the ground. So I've added those into a nice little special group. Also, people that are friends to me and also the channel. It's like Bobby Maggie, who sent me some barbecue freaking sauce. <laughs> He's in there for example and there's also attendees of the uk meetup from previous years people that i've actually freaking shook hands with that aren't really backers of the channel like golden deck geck and things but i've met in real life that are awesome people they're in there too so yeah and i'm hopefully going to build be bu building out that list as well of some of the pedigree chums yes my pedigree chums they can also join in too so there's that going on so yeah regulars over on discord so people that were helping for wender quest like grim i've added you in <laughs> yeah and and a few others so you, you should be able to Go on over and hit it up and see if you've got access. If you haven't got access, DM me and I'll try and add you in for following week. If I feel that you should be in there. There you go, Slutamondo. Okay, so there we are. So Discord link only above persons can join. It's a restricted chat. I don't want it to be chaos, especially for the first episode, because I need to see if this thing works. So yeah, it's restricted access to YouTube members, Patreon members, and also pedigree chums. It's probably about... 80 people in total that i have allowed access to so it's it is quite all encompassing yeah hopefully you're encompassed in it if you're not like i say dm me if you feel that you want to be in there i will then set the podcast live for all people at 9 p.m so this goes live at 6 p.m i'm hopefully going to do it for an hour to 7 p.m then raid somebody and then after after that raid, after that stream's ended, I'm then going to chuck it live because I don't really want to detract from people that have raided out there, you know? And then people can watch it back and they can see what actually happened. But mainly, this is a podcast, so it's more of a treat for the ear holes anyway. So having listen and talk access is all you really need. The actual watch access is going to be very much like my Discordy type stuff. If you haven't tuned into one of my Discords... This is what the setup looks like for the Discord. So yeah, down here it's just going to have the Discord chat down there. I, mean, I can chuck Discord on the screen at the moment if you like over here. Boom. Well, there's, that, that's kind of the Discordy chatty thing. If I go into my actual area down here, boom, and go into there, pow. That's kind of what it looks like. And then there'll be other people all dialed in here and stuff like that. The live chat will be taking place in that sort of window where you can see the jellyfish right now. So yeah, there's not going to be much visually on screen apart from if people turn on their webcams. So it's it's not much of a treat for the eye peepers is what I'm getting at, people. Heck no. No, it's not. Yeah, all my members should be able to join, so that should be nice. You can see some of the members up in that top right-hand corner up there, which is pretty darn lovely. So yeah, if you want to go and grab yourself a membership, it's open to all members as well, people in the view of us. So yeah, it's 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 pretty cool because at that tier, I think I think my lowest tier is like one ninety nine or something. You get to use all the emojis. You get to join in with members live chat, and into this Discord for Mondays mooching. Yeah, so yeah, Mondays members mooch. Mmm, <laughs> yummy, yummy. Anyway, talking of something that's yummy and mmm inspiring, back to my tea. Oh, that's a lovely tea. This is this is a Tetley. This one. This is a Tetley brew. Freaking love it. Yeah, I've got a few different breakfast teas. Some of my favourites: Yorkshire tea. I like uh, peachy tips and also Tetley. Yes, and this was a Tetley. This one. Lovely. I also tried Red Bush, which was actually quite nice. I also tried the Tesco's own breed of tea bag the other month. That was all right. Not bad. Anyway, people, enough about tea and enough about everything else. I think that's a reasonable stopping point. So, yeah, just a heads up. My freaking <laughs> wonders tab is completely foobard. And, um, yeah, let us know if yours is as well, people, in the view of us. And until next time, you guys have been freaking awesome. I'm hopefully going to see you on the Monday for the Monday Mooch. But, you know, it's Friday today. Oh, but this might go live at the weekend. Yeah. Anyway, hopefully I've already seen you for the the uh, Friday shenanigans with the, <laughs> the old weekend mission stuffage. Anyway, have a good one. Take care. Cheery bye. Enjoy your weekend, people. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.